good morning and welcome in. I am the Canadian trucker Rudy and I am here with Diego. I'm Trucker's Rudy's son. Well, thank you guys for joining my channel and stay tuned for the rest of my day. Fixing to leave the TA up here. Yeah. I was really lucky to get this spot here last night. There was pretty much only this one spot left that was uh, for free. There's a couple of spots over there for where you had to pay for the spots, but. <laughs> This was the uh, only one that was uh, left open there, so no, I guess nobody wanted to uh, back her in there, so well, I guess this guy thinks he has to pay for her here, for this place, but there's nobody in here, so I guess they used to charge here, but not anymore. So we gotta go this way. Well, it's not a very, very big TA, but it's, it's a decent size, you know. We've had a, we have had ourselves a good night's sleep and I've been lazy. I've been lazy getting her going here today. Just received a message this morning that uh, we don't really have any loads going back home from Toronto, so uh, they want me to take a load uh, from Toronto to Ohio. Which I do have the hours to do that, and even to come back from uh, Ohio to Toronto, but... Uh, yeah, it's kind of tight though. Well, I mean, not really tight to get back to Toronto, but once I get back to Toronto, then I'll be uh, pretty much out of hours. I'll probably have a little bit left, but I mean on Tuesday I get hours back too for the Canadian side, so I might be all right. I just might be all right. It's kind of strange the way they wrote you out of here, but we made it. Now we just gotta wait for the slide. Turn oh, there left we go. on West Johnson Avenue. Okay, you wanna go too? Alrighty, I guess we will go down to Hazel Junction and uh, pick up our uh, preloaded trailer over there and bring her over to Mississauga. I looked it up on the uh, on the laptop there, and it is actually about. 930 kilometers, I think it was all together, so just shy of 600 miles from from here to uh, in a quarter mile. Take Hazleton the entrance to, to the Toronto. left on 84 West. I don't know if we'll make it today. I doubt it because it's already nine o'clock, which is 10 o'clock Eastern time, or actually 9:15 already. And so. Uh, I don't know if I want to drive that late. In 600 feet, take the entrance to the left on I-84 West. Because, uh... My load only needs to be in uh, Columbus, Ohio for Monday on the 1st at 1 o'clock in the afternoon. And I think that was only like seven and a half hour drive or something like that. It was, it was not even 700 kilometers, so... So no real rush to get down there anyway, so may as well take it easy. But hey, if Jukebox, hey, if you are all of a sudden in the Columbus area on Monday, let me know, buddy. Let me know, buddy. I will see if I see you there. Maybe we can meet up. Continue on this road for eight miles. Let's get out of here, put the hammer down, have our 
yourself an awesome day. I hope you guys are having a fantastic weekend. I know it's always a week later than uh, when I'm recording this show, but hey, maybe next weekend is a great weekend for you to go camping or do whatever, maybe barbecuing or having a good old time with your buddies or maybe with your family and friends, whatever it is. We appreciate if you uh, come along and travel with us on the, on the short little video like we always do. It's usually only between 15, 10 and 15 minutes, sometimes 20 minutes, but hey, if you take out 15 minutes out of your day and watch me, that means the world to me, you know? Because I do this for you guys. I love doing what I'm doing, but if nobody is watching, then I may as well not have videos, right? But So, I do appreciate you guys very much that uh, you are loyal to my channel. And a lot of you are watching every day. So, we appreciate that. Thank you, guys. So, let's get down to Hazleton. And we will see you on the road somewhere. Alrighty guys, we are on I-84 westbound and check this out. We got a fairly big, uh, I don't know if you could call it lake or river. It looks fairly big. Not too sure what it's called because I'm not familiar with this area. I don't remember ever crossing this here before. but Looks pretty interesting so I figured well. I give you guys the view. Yep. Yeah. That's what we like to do. We like to give you guys some good sceneries. I think this is it. I love water. Lakes. There's actually a fairly big boat up there. Smaller sailboat up there. Oh yeah. That looks fairly big. Must be fairly deep water. Probably some good fishing up here too. I bet. But we are already in New York. State that is. New York State. Yep. We got about 142 miles to go and we'll be in Hazleton, Pennsylvania. We'll be picking up our reload. GPS says I should be there around 2 o'clock this afternoon. That's Eastern Time, of course. Eastern Time. Yeah. Well, that sure was interesting. We are about 12 miles away, or I guess 9 miles by now. Earlier I looked almost 12, but... Yeah, we are about 9 miles away from our pickup here in Hazleton, Pennsylvania. Just look at the gorgeous, beautiful Rockies up here, or mountains, or hills, whatever you want to call it. It's just absolutely gorgeous. It's a beautiful day out here today again. Yep. Oh yeah. So let's go pick up our reload and uh, make our way over to Toronto. Just look to the right over here, guys. That's a big drop off. Hey, we're going up on the hill right now. And we are getting closer. Yeah, up here some areas are pretty hilly, but yeah, sometimes it's gorgeous, you know. But other times it's not so gorgeous. <laughs> here we go, guys. We just finished picking up our load over here in uh, Hazleton. Now we are making our way over to uh, Mississauga, Ontario. Yeah, then we got about 360 miles to go. I don't think we'll do that today, but we got to leave something for tomorrow. So we can do a little bit of driving tomorrow too, you know. Yeah, well, no, I'm not, not in any, uh, any rush because... Uh, the load that I'm picking up at the terminal there tomorrow is only be delivered uh, on Monday at 1 in the afternoon, so not in any big rush, so we'll just drive.
drive for a couple of hours and then I shut her down. Yeah. Then we'll continue on tomorrow. Hey guys, we are in Mississauga, Ontario. Yeah, so I'm finished for today. We have had ourselves an excellent day today. I never even thought I was going to go to Mississauga today, to be honest with you guys. But, uh, hey, I did. I did. We went to Master Steak and we had ourselves a nice steak up here, that's for sure. Oh, yeah. Now I'm ready for bed. It's bedtime for me. So, hope you guys had a good day today or you are going to have a good day today. And we will see you again tomorrow at 2 a.m., some of you at least. So have a good one. We'll catch you on the next one. It's time to get going. It's time to move on. Put this behind me.